She's back with my mouth. No fit talk up. Good morning, MC Kevin. Kai, good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning. <laughs> good morning, Elila <laughs> Igwamu. Uh, good morning to all my Muslim brothers out there. Eh? We are celebrating. Uh, uh, what day are we celebrating today? Koi, we celebrated uh, Ramadan yesterday. Koi, we are extending it today. And that is why we want to stay. Uh, uh, you know, it is thanks to the determination of the head of state, His Excellency President Paul Bia, that we are celebrating today. Mm? You know, he's extended it today to a public holiday. So I want to say uh, happy, happy Ramadan. Happy Ramadan. How do they say it? Uh, 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 uh. Uh, El Mubarak uh, uh, to all of my Muslim brothers out there. So I want to say uh, Ele like Bamu to all of you ladies and gentlemen. Welcome, welcome, welcome to I know that beautiful day Allah have created for us to celebrate together. So I telling you this morning, good morning, Tatafi. Actually, you are looking excellently beautiful this morning. Thank you. Thank oh, thank oh. You, thank you. you know, when Allah creates a beautiful people like this, it's just to appreciate them. You know, um, 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 I don't read the Quran often, but I read the Bible. Oh. The Bible says a beautiful woman that honors the Lord is worthy of praise all the time. Indeed. indeed. That is why all the time I always look at means to tell you I'm beautiful. Quite. Thank you, Quite. thank you, thank you. If I look at a beautiful baby like you, okay. I just right. talk to tell okay. her she's beautiful. Yeah. And uh, this morning you extremely beautiful. Yeah, you've said that like Oh, that. Lala, I just feel like saying I it all something. day. But you know, it's thanks to the determination of the heat of this <laughs> that we have beautiful people like you presenting program every morning. You know what it feels that every morning you wake up, you look at somebody beautiful sitting in front of your TV set. It's, it's thanks to the determination and hard work of the head of state, His Excellency President Paul Bia, that you have beautiful people like you presenting program on TV. Wow. So we want to say thanks to the president or the head of state, His Excellency President Paul Bia, this morning. You know we are celebrating. Okay. All right. Yeah. We're not going to really go on and on. Like. But yeah, I want to I want to say good morning and celebrate Ramadan with all my Muslim brothers. Please. A yesterday, question. Yes. A quick question. Where were you yesterday? I went to see my brother Musa, uh, uh, Musa, Musa in in Bova. Well, what did Musa offer you? Offer you? Musa offered me chicken. Chicken, not lamb or. The... No, he offered me chicken. Really? Yes, that because, is all. Just that because with all this, this, this. Uh, uh, Muslim arsenal. I don't no, it's start. today. It's today that I am going to eat all the ram and all the cows. So, okay. Today I am going to Boya Town. I am going to meet the Imam himself, the Imam of the Boya Town Mosque. We are going to uh, eat the cow. Invited? I am inviting myself. You know, when we celebrate Ramadan, we don't need to invite. We just need to know that yeah, it's a celebration. Sharing, yes, we just, just, just have to brain, share. Just you know what happened? We were at the mosque yesterday. Hmm? You know, at the mosque, the imam, before a Ramadan appears like this, there is a revelation that Allah tells the imam. So what the, um, the revelation that Allah gave the imam yesterday was that, as we were doing, as we were praying, Allah, Akuba, that as we're going down like that, the first person to take the head up is the person that will go for sacrifice. <laughs> So as that revelation I, came like that, as I've a revelation the end of this story, oh my god. Oh as my a god. revelation came like that, Imam as a good person, he said he should tell his son, one never knows, you better be careful. It's better to be saved than to be a uh, sorry. So he told his son that my son, as you see like that, we're going to this Ramadan in the mosque. When I do a like but don't take your head up, face man. You know this stubborn son, he asked Papa, why are you telling me not to take my head up? I must know. They said, no, don't just take your head up, wait for people. He said, no, Papa, tell me first. That is how Imam, tell him, son, that if you take your head up, you will go for sacrifice, according to what Allah told me last night. The son, too, has a very good boy. He said, Papa, I have heard. He went to, he has his one good friend, his very best friend in the Imam, <laughs> in, the, in, the, in the mosque. He went and told his friend that, you know, you are my very good friend. I have to tell you this thing, but don't tell anybody. You know, you are my very good friend. I don't want you to go to sacrifice. He told his friend the same story. His friend too had his very good father. He said he would tell his father. He loves his father so very much. He went and told his father. His father had his very good friend in that same mosque. He went and told his friend 
That is how the entire mosque knew the whole issue. <laughs> so when the imam came now, he was doing well, uh, as he stood like that, he was expecting people to go up. He told everybody was like that. <laughs> Nobody is going up. He told everybody is like that. 